Um, okay, I don't know if this is out of line. We often hear that you talk about your mother and we've seen pictures of her, but I don't think that we've ever seen your dad or heard him or heard about him. How is your relationship uh, with him? I have no relationship with my father. Uh, also, are you both are both your parents from Europe or just from your mother? My mother was born in Europe, but uh, my father is Italian, but he's you know six generations American or something, or actually maybe three gener generations. And his great and his grandmother was Russian. So on that side, I have Russian and Italian, but um, I don't I don't we don't talk. We have no relationship. Okay, so Maria. When you tell people about your job, what question do you get asked the most? I've learned, well, friends know, so friends sometimes, you know, I tell them whatever they ask me, but but people that I'm, like, just meeting for a little bit, like maybe getting my hair cut or a manicure or I'm at a school function, whatever, if someone asks me what I do, I just say I'm a writer. Now, I started saying I'm a writer because if I say I'm a blogger, or if I say I'm a celebrity gossip blogger, forget it. I'll be three hours answering questions. How do I start my blog? How do you get the information? Do you know any celebrities? Can you give me this person's email information? I mean, it becomes like this big, like, oh, I want to do that too. And it's so hard to explain that I didn't just wake up and start blogging and all of a sudden get like 5 million page views a month. Like it took years and years and years of effort. So, um... I just say writer. I go, I'm a writer. And then that kind of, like, people are like, oh, what do you write? I write about beauty and fashion. And then that kind of ends it. I don't even say celebrity gossip anymore because it just takes me down this, like, whole different path. Okay, so the last question. You and Bill look like such a gorgeous couple. This is, like, so flattering. All you people are saying, like, such nice things. Just wanted to know what were your first impressions of each other. Hmm. Okay, so when we were in college... We met at a business fraternity, and um, what were my impressions of him? He was, he had a girlfriend. I mean, like, seriously, he had a girlfriend. And I was like, that he was going to break up with or something because he was just waiting for school to end. And he, he, like, I met him as a friend first. And then he was like, I have a girlfriend, but I'm literally waiting to May to break up with her. And then we started hanging out because we were in the same fraternity. It was a co-ed fraternity for business. And I don't know, like, he was, like, really funny, like, my big thing is for guys, like for me to be attracted to a guy, one of the things that I absolutely love is to laugh. Like I love Bill because Bill is so funny. I find him so funny. I mean, maybe not everyone's humor will agree with him, but he literally is hilarious to me. Like I, we sit on the couch every night and we like make fun of what we're watching on television or whatever. It is, it is, it is always a party. I always am having a good time with my husband. And I felt that right away with him. Like, I knew that I was going to marry him in a month. In one month. I was like, this is, the, this is who I'm supposed to marry. And, you know, my other relationships that I had in my life, you know, I, I, I'm going to just chalk it down to just being young and, and not really knowing what is best for you. And, and so, like, I've made a lot of mistakes, as we've all made, I'm sure, but Bill was the first, like, good guy, good guy that I met and that I was attracted to and that, you know, I, I just really enjoyed him. And I knew when I was in college, I was, like, a little hoochie. Like, I used to dress really, not provocative, but, you know, tight. Everything was tight. I was 120 pounds, you know, tight, 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 tight. So I know that he was kind of into that when we met because I remember, like, a few instances in my head about, comments that he made so I don't know it's just it just worked I mean it was like we were meant to meet at that fraternity we were meant to meet we were meant to marry and um 10 years later it's still all good so this is like a super long video I'm gonna cut it in half um all right so that's it really long I'm sorry if you have any other questions um just leave your questions on the bottom